Mike Callahan, Dr. Fowlfinder, and welcome back to part 9 of our special 10-part series on Irfan View. Today we're going to cover the rest of the available options. We covered the first part in the previous tutorial. So with Irfan View open, we're going to click Options, Properties and Settings. Now this time you're going to want to click on the tab that starts off with JPG, because we'll cover this row. In this tab, it lets you determine what size photo CDs to load. You can tell Earthen View to play animated GIF files by default. You can have it load all graphics files as grayscales by default, and so on. Now, the Extensions tab is a handy tab because you can configure exactly what file formats you want Earthen View to handle. So if there's a particular file format you didn't want to be pulled into Earthen View automatically when you clicked on it, you could configure that here. So as a rough example, say you have a program like Microangelo that deals with animated window cursors. And if you wanted Microangelo to work with that, then you wouldn't select it in Earthen View, but you could select all of your other graphics formats. So it gives you a lot of control over which files get pulled into Earthen View. You can also add Earthen View to the SendTube menu, and there's a specific tutorial already on that. And you can add Browse with Earthen View to drives and folders in the Shell menu. Now, on the File Handling tab, you can set up specific directories or folders to copy and move file logs to when those dialogs come up. You can also control a lot of aspects about deleting files, like whether you should be asked before deleting, to whether to delete things to the recycle bin, close Earthen View after delete, and so on. Now the Viewing tab basically covers some advanced things on ping and TGA files, dithering of BPP files, and so on. And it also lets you configure the main window color. As you see back here, it's black. It's black because it's black here. I can click on that. I can change it to blue. Say OK. If I say OK again, it changes it to blue. So we'll go back here. And the last tab is the full screen tab. And this lets you configure basically how full screen mode is going to act. You can have it fit to screen for large images. You can have images stretch so that they fit the screen. You can have it resample. You can have multiple monitor mode so that you can stretch an image over two or more monitors. You can have text that shows the, the folder, the name, the file index, and you can determine whether that text is shown at the top, middle, bottom, left, center, or right, whether the text is transparent, the screen color, the font and the font color, and so on. So. We've now covered all of the available options in Earthen View, and again, as I said in the previous segment, the purpose here was to make you aware of all of the many options that Earthen View has so that you can use them and browse through them at, at your own speed. And that concludes part nine.